Greetings, I'm Bishop Eric Kincaid Clark. Today's Megabyte comes to us from the book of Judges. Judges picks up where the story of Joshua ends. Unlike Moses, who had a successor in the person of Joshua, Joshua did not have a successor. And my observation is that success without a successor is no success at all. I want you to ask yourself a question. Who is going to take over the leadership of your household or your family beyond your life? Making sure that you train up your children, your grandchildren, even those for business or ministry that can carry the baton after you is very important. Judges chapter one and chapter two reveals that after Joshua died, the people fell back into an idolatrous state. They left God. It seemed like when they had good leadership, the people followed the Lord as they were being led. And then once there was no leadership, every man did that which was right in their own eyes. Judges chapter one and two characterizes Israel's backslidden condition and how they cried out to God. And the Lord began a cycle of raising up good godly leadership who delivered Israel from their bondage and put them back on a course towards righteousness. My second observation today is that leadership is very important. Remember, if the blind lead the blind, they both fall into a ditch. I'm Bishop Eric Kincaid Clark, and this has been your Megabyte.